Hello everyone, um, this is a new Klaus Schnell extravaganza video. Uh, hope everyone's doing alright. Um, just thought I'd get straight onto the books here. Uh, as you can see, I don't know if anyone's actually seen this book before, but this was limited to 500 copies. Um, it's actually a fanzine um, called Your Days Are Numbered. Um, this is number four. And uh, this artwork on the cover is by David Ziggy Green. Uh, quite unusual cover. It sort of attracted me, so I bought it. This was off eBay. Um, I've looked recently. There's actually no copies of this at all floating about. Um, so it's quite rare, this uh, fanzine. Uh, from 2012, and if you can see the characters, if any of you can spot any of these, there's Batman, Wonder Woman, uh, Optimus Prime, Swamp Thing, Galactus, uh, Scarlet Witch, Rorschach, Kick-Ass, Judge Dredd, Spider-Man, uh, Captain America, and I think this character's out of Transmetropolitan. On the weird glasses, but anyway, yeah, nice book to have. I like the cover. Yeah, it's sort of like a floating heads cover, but uh, I don't know something about it. <laughs> so we'll move on. Uh, this is Marvel Team Up number one forty one. Um, this is an early symbiote Spider-Man uh, issue. I think this is one of the first ones. This is like a prelude to um, Secret Wars. Uh, yeah, this was a nice book to have. Um, I paid only a pound for this. Um, I've seen it go for a between from between ten and uh, as much. You wouldn't believe this as much as a hundred and forty pound for this book, which I think's overpriced again. Like eBay is these days, you know, you look up these highest prices, and yeah, a raw copy of this is going for a hundred and forty pound. Um, personally, I'd say it's between ten and twenty. This is worth. I might be wrong. I don't know because I don't follow the price guides or anything like that. I just go by my judgment. Um, so yeah, this was a nice book to purchase, and I've also got the last issue, which is uh, Marvel Team Up number 150. Uh, again, happy to have this. This was only a pound. Uh, I've seen this been go going for as less as less than five actually. This book, and uh, as much as fifteen. So uh, I would say that's a pretty fair price. For this you know um, don't know how rare this last issue is if anyone can sort of tell me I don't know I'm not really too sure then we have um, continuing you know late to the Daredevil stuff we've got Daredevil 254 and this is uh, the first appearance of Typhoid Mary this book has really gone up um, I only paid a pound for this a near mint copy without a doubt and uh, I'm seeing this go for as much as 45 in raw, so this was very. I was very happy to pick this up. I've had this for a while now. This book, so you know, these all, all these books I'm showing in this uh, this video I've had for quite some time. I'm just getting around to showing them. I have been picking picking a lot of books up lately, and I'll be doing a haul with that real soon. Um, continuing Daredevil 258. Uh, this is the first appearance of uh, Bengal. And I don't think this one's on the radar at the moment. I've been seeing this book going for, you know, less than five again, and as much as six, maybe seven. So, yeah, this book's easily obtainable if you're after, like, key issues of any sort of characters and that. This is the first appearance of Bengal. Uh, right, this is a nice one. I picked all these up, all four parts, 417 to 420. Um, Batman, Ten Nights of the Beast. This is the first appearance of uh, KG Beast. Um, all these books are in between fine plus to very fine. So, uh, And I paid about £5 for all these, so I was very happy. A good Mike Zek cover there. I really like the uh, background there. The way the uh, picture's angled. It's very good. And then we have uh, 
number 418, another good cover. 419 with KG Beast on the cover. And 420, and I've also got another copy of this which I've had for many years, given to, 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 uh, given to me by an old friend. And uh, yeah, I will read that at some point. Right, we have um, Uncanny X Men number 244. This is the first appearance of uh, Jubilee. I've been seeing this book going for as much as 200. In raw, no word of a lie. Two hundred, I've seen this go for, which is a bit pricey, if you ask me. Again, I'd probably say this book's between ten and maybe thirty, forty, something like that. Um, I've got two copies of this actually. One's in fine plus, the other in very fine. So yeah, they were nice pickups. One was a pound, the other one was two. And then for my final book, um, we've got uh, X Men number thirty-five. I've had this book for many years now, um, but I thought I'd show it off again. Um, this has been my lard and a fresh back and board, and it looks beautiful. Uh, fine plus copy. I paid originally about £20 for this book back in 2003-2004 time. Um, I'm seeing it go for now 200 no problem. This book's really gone up in price. Uh, it's the first appearance of a character called the Changeling, who I don't really know too much about. And it's also an early appearance with Spider-Man and the X-Men together. So, yep, yeah, I'm really happy to have this book. Um, Always catches my eye, very eye appealing cover. And uh, yeah, I thought I'd share that with you. So um, that wraps up another video for now. This is only going to be short because I don't want to make my videos too long. Um, I've got loads more books to show, so stay tuned. Thanks a lot.